My God. That's in every habit that you had. Boom. Boom, 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 boom. Boom. Boom, boom, boom. God is saying, for where he'll, it's a miracle because of where he'll take you to. My God. Bible salvation. Last point. Keep reading the text. Verse number two again. And he brought me up also out of a horrible pit. Yes. Out of the miry clay. Horrible pit of sin. Miracle out of the miry clay. That's like quicksand will suck you in. We were bound, my God. Come on, brought us about all of that. Read. And set my feet upon a rock. Set my feet upon a rock. Salvation. And Read. And establish my going. And establish my goings. It's a miracle because how he will keep you despite the world, the flesh, and the devil. Establish means to set up on a firm and permanent basis. God is able not only to deliver you, but God is able to keep you. That's a miracle in and of itself. You do not have to be in and out, up and down. My God, God is able to keep you. Thank the Lord. Go to Philippians chapter 2, verse 13. My God, God is able. It's a miracle. Despite all the devil may try to do, despite all old spirits that may try to come back, God is able to keep you. A miracle. Come on and read. Somebody this morning is in need of a miracle. Somebody this morning is in need of a miracle. I don't know what you're going through, but God is saying this morning, it's time to come home. God is saying this morning, it's time to get aligned with me. My God, my God. Things are happening in your life to get your attention. Right now. Things are happening right now, some things you're going through. God is trying to get your attention. He's saying, I understand you're dealing with a mess. It's a lot going on, but I got a miracle for you. I'll work out every detail. Just come. I work out every nuance. Just come. I've been going to church, but things are still out of order, though. That's the problem. God is saying, I got a miracle of real salvation. Full deliverance for you this morning. Let's see how he's able to keep. Come on and read. For it is God yes. which worketh in you, uh -huh. both to will and to do of this good pleasure. Hold on. It is God that will work in you. When you come down to this altar of prayer in a few moments, and you say, Lord, I'm dealing with some messy stuff. Step on my children out of order. My, uh, as, a, as a father, <laughs> as a mother. <laughs> See, you got to be humble if you're going to get right. <laughs> Lord, I'm just being real with you. There's some things that are out of order in my life. I'm humbling myself. I know it looked good. I know my hair is done. I know I got this. My suit is all good. But Lord, I'm being real. You see beyond all this stuff. Oh there's some things in my heart there, God. There's some things in my life, Lord. I just need you. I can't work this out myself. I need you to help me. When a person comes to God humbly in faith, believing that God is able to perform that miracle that's needed, it said, it is God that worketh in you both the will that's a desire. He'll give you the desire to do right. And the do, that means the ability to perform what your new desire is. The new desire I want to do right. For the rest of my life, God, if you delay your coming another six weeks, All right, God. God is on his way back. Yeah. If you come in six weeks and end this thing, from now to six weeks, all I want to do is to be a woman of prayer. Yeah. I just want to be a woman of God. From this time, I've done me enough. I've smoked enough. I've drunk yeah. enough. Yeah. I've parted enough. I've done, yeah. I've done me enough. Yeah. I've done enough of me, God. I want you to be all in me and, do, and just have your way with me. You may use me to uh, get my grandchildren. They need God. They do with stuff online and stuff in school. They do with stuff all over the place. They need power. They do with spirits. They need a prayer warrior. They need someone that can get a prayer through. And the Bible said, if I regard iniquity in my heart, my prayers won't be heard. Lord, I've been doing some, I'm praying, but there's a power lacking in it because some stuff in my life. It's my fault. I'm not going to look at them and say, they're so bad. They do with this. No, Lord, I'm owning this. I need your help this morning. I need you to give me a new desire. It said it is God that worketh in you. The desire and the do. That means the power to perform. It's a miracle because he'll keep you. Keep reading, my friend. We're almost done with this. Read. For it is God that worketh in you. Yes. Both to will and to do. Yes. Of his good pleasure. Yes, sir. Do all things. Yes. Without murmuring and disputing. Come on, read. That you may be blameless. Yes. And harmless. Yes. The sons of God. Yes. Without rebuke. Come on. In the midst of a crooked. How can I live right? Angel. But leave so much dirt in Jackson. There's so much power. It's a miracle. It's a miracle how he can do, create you the will and the do of his good pleasure. And then in the midst of a crooked, crooked and perverse world. 
ungodliness all around keep you. Jews said unto him that's able to keep us from falling. Amen. My God, that's a miracle. Hello. Everybody around you just hate, dirt, this and that, and you live in hope. Miracle. Hi. This morning, God is saying, I got a miracle for you. Don't you let no man minimize what I'm able to do. You don't have to sing no song. We fall down, but we get up. We fall. Where is the power at? The devil is trying to make me fall. God is trying to keep me up. And you telling me I got to fall and get up. I got to repent every night. No, I don't. The Bible said unto him that's able to keep us from falling. The Bible said greater is he that's in me than he that's in the world. I can do all things through Christ. It's a miracle. It's not man. And most people no longer believe in miracles. They say miracles, that's for the Bible age. But we're here today to let you know the Bible said Jesus Christ all right, all the right. same yesterday, yesterday, today, 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 and forever. My God, it's amen. a miracle amen. with your name on it. God is oh. able. And lastly, there was a woman at the well. If you read the text, it said he'll put a new song in my heart. Praises unto God. Yeah. There's a woman at the well, and he told that woman, he said, you drink of that water. It's a miracle of satisfaction. You're going to sing a song of satisfaction. Lord, I'm satisfied in Jesus. Amen. My God, my God. He said, you drink of that water. You're going to thirst again. I don't care what on earth. You're going to thirst again. You can hit the lottery for a million dollars. It still won't satisfy your soul thirst. You can find that guy, he's six foot this, tall, dark, hand, this, that, and the other. It still is going to be something deep down in you that's not satisfied. You can be the number one draft pick, but still there's going to be something deep down. Drink of this water. Go ahead and drink of this world's water. But Jesus said, if you drink of my well, he said you will never thirst again. Never. You won't have no withdrawals. It's a miracle of satisfaction. When you come to God, you have no regrets. Right, You'll say, Lord, I'm done. I'm done, God. And what God gives you in return, you will never even think about. Right, God. Not even a temptation may come. But God will give you power to resist Amen. it. Amen. I believe this morning there's somebody tuning in, somebody that's here this morning, that their life is in need of a miracle. They can go to man all they want. They can say this, that, and the other. But God has allowed things to take place to let them know it's a mess. You can try to put the cover on all you want, dress like titties, then it's a mess. You can try to figure it out, so I'm going to go to school, and I'm going to do it. It's a mess. It's a mess. It's a mess. Humble yourself. What I have for you is a miracle, though. I'll break every yoke. I'll straighten out everything that's out of order. My God. I'll give you everything you need, the power, the glory, Amen. and I'll satisfy you. Amen. You won't have no withdrawals. Amen. You won't even think about your past. If you can just humble yourself, I'll take you from a mess to a miracle. Every saint child that's tuning in, amen, I understand what you're dealing with. I understand you're nervous with COVID-19. I understand you're nervous with this, that, or the other. But God is saying this morning, I have a miracle for you. I understand it's a, a mess. I understand your finances is out of order. You couldn't come up with $1,000 cash right now if you wanted to. You owe this person and that person. Your finances are a mess. Your relationships are a mess. You can try to put it all you want. Look, go out to eat. All. You know and I know it's a mess. Y'all not bonding. Y'all not together. Y'all got issues. Y'all got this, that, and the other. Your children are a mess. They dealing with issues and stuff you covered up. If you was to tell everybody the stuff your children are dealing with right now, it'll make you and make your grandchildren life is a mess. All these things are out of order. But God said, I'm not here to judge you this morning. I got a miracle for you. You came here today. Amen. I still live. I'm still able. The blood still flows. I have a blessing for you. I have a miracle for you. Shall we stand? From a mess to a miracle. From a mess to a miracle. If there's any that want prayer, I want you to come down this time. We believe God brought you here. Meet me here at the altar. Meet me here at the altar. I came here and God spoke to me. God spoke to me. I need it. I need that miracle. As they sing the song, all those that God dealt with, that are dealing with something. You gotta humble yourself though. You gotta humble yourself. It's you and God. We're not talking about joining church. We're not talking about anything like that. But Lord, there's some stuff that's out of line. I'm humbling myself. I want to align with your perfect will. As they sing, you come on down. We're going to pray with you. Thank you, Lord. Have your way this morning. Bye, bye, bye. If there's one
Lord, just going down. So I need it. I need it. I need my miracle. I need it. I need it. Amen. I need it. He is able to deliver the old sin. Whatever it is. The old life is in his hand. But you live at his command. He's the source of the other blessing. Yes, Lord. I'm going to church. But I need that greater power.